Ever since modern Western medicine was introduced to China in the 19th century, there's been long, long debates over whether traditional Chinese medicine should still be used. But China's latest victory in the Nobel Prize medicine category may help the out-of-fashion treatment regain its glory. Tu Youyou, an 84-year-old Chinese medical scientist, won the share of the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine in developing an effective drug to treat malaria. She's the first ever female Chinese citizen to win a Nobel Prize and the first mainland Chinese citizen to ever win in a scientific discipline. The discovery of the drug was a result of a program established by Mao Zedong in the early 1970s. The mission was to find a cure for malaria that would help North Vietnam in their fight with South Vietnam and the U.S., Chinese state media says. Traditional Chinese medicine has been around for over 2,000 years and incorporates various forms of herbal medicine, acupuncture, and massage therapy. All the recipes are listed in Chinese medical books, and that's where Miss Tu found the answer to malaria. Following the recipe, Tu and her team extracted artemisinin from a sweet wormwood plant that proved unusually effective in fighting the disease. The finding also won her a prestigious Lasker Medical Research Award in 2011. While the Chinese medicine world is cheering for its hard-earned global recognition in the field, some people think the extraction of chemical compound from a plant is a modern medical approach, whereas traditional Chinese medicine suggests taking them all together. The official Nobel Committee also wants to avoid giving too much credit to traditional Chinese treatment. We see it as the inspiration was coming from traditional Chinese medicine, but then the, the drug has made all the journey up to a, a modern drug that is tested in every way.